you know, I'm happy to admit that I've seen a therapist in my, you know, in my life because it's important. KSI, we need therapists after listening to your song on repeat in our heads for the thousand times. Let's be honest, the rhythm is catchy, but the lyrics are ass. From the screen to the ring, meaning he was a YouTuber, he expanded to become a boxer. Basically, the whole song he said in one of his videos that it represents his life. I'm going to make a music about my life. Sure, from the screen to the ring to the pen. Sure, you become a rapper. But after that, from the screen to the ring to the pen to the king. Who called you a king? The first three were good, but the last one ruined it. Did one of your little Timmy's comment it up in your comment section on your YouTube video saying, Oh my, I love you, my king. And he was like, thank you for the next lyrics of my song. Now, this has been one of the top three worst phases of what KSI is going through through his whole career. He was the nightmare, but Dan TDM took away his title after making one post, just one post. And he started giving KSI nightmares. KSI used the hate that he was getting for, you know, going after Dan TDM to promote his new song. Everything was going far for KSA. He was all haha making fun of Dan TDM. But then after he released his song, everyone just jumped on him. Even the people who are not going to roast them started roasting him because of the whole drama. Dan TDM stuff, Lunchly stuff, the responses is giving everyone oh my god, it's okay, it's fine. But then he went on three days ago with Aiden Ross on a live stream because his team forced him to, and he had a full-on breakdown. First off, how are you, man? Are you you doing okay? You're getting bullied on the internet. Yeah, right? I'm, I'm, I'm great. Yeah, fantastic. Yeah. Look, dude, look at it like this. You're going crazy on the internet right now because of the song, but hey, uh -huh. it's growing on people. It's growing. It's like, it's. I'm not even joking. At first, I thought it was. What do you mean? What do you mean? It's growing on people. It's a good song. It's always been a good song. So I don't understand what you mean by it's growing on people. Well, it's always well, been good. well. To be real, he's way too lost into his own ego. He can't accept any comment, any feedback from people unless it's positive. Anyone tells him, oh, maybe this part should have been a little bit better maybe he could have done this with this it doesn't matter if it's song or not you just can't accept any negative feedback you have to like it because if you don't you don't have any taste that's where his head is at um i'll be real bro is the song something i'm gonna play in my car no but it's a meme song and i like the song for the meme purposes and it's good well, it's not meant to be a meme song you know well, it's what? a meme no, no, no. song you know no it's it. not a meme song though. it's not what you on about it's not Man, a meme song but you know it's a meme song KSI, you make good songs. You that holiday song is my favorite song you've ever wrote. And it's, done. Yeah, but if I release holiday now, it would have turned into a meme song. No, I like you know, that. Everyone song. would be like, ah, oh, this no. Disney ah. No. This it's, stupid ah. No, but that's a cringe, good ah. That's a good song. But this song that you made, it has a meme built up to it. You gotta just go with the wave, bro. Don't what fight do it. What do you mean? It's a, no, I'm a fire, so I'm gonna fight it. It's bullshit. But are you really that pressed over it, it being a meme or are, Yes! Why are you because it's my music, Bo. I don't think you understand. When you spend your time, hours in the in the studio, working on on beats, working on music, working on lyrics to make sure you you have the best of the best, and you release that into the world, and people then go, ah, oh, ass, ah, oh, oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna die. But by the way, KSI songs playing. Let me pause that before I go back to dying again. Like oh, these memes are stupid. And it's pissing me off. I'm sorry. And I'm... it's annoying, but I, there's nothing I can do. Now, it's good to see KSI not laughing after every sentence. But we have to come to realization that this is who he is. And the lyrics, he actually thinks they're good, even though they're not. He said, I'm a fighter. That's why I'm going to fight. No, I'm a fighter, so I'm going to fight it. I'm very happy that he did not put that in his song. But let's just move on. You wrote, you wrote the song or did you have a ghostwriter? Yeah, I wrote, I wrote. It's good, it's good, good lyrics. You... Now this guy on the left, the donkey brain guy, Aiden, we talked about him yesterday. He is not a good influence on people, but, it, but when it comes to rage baits, he is number uno. He's obviously here to troll KSI, and I am not shocked that KSI wrote the lyrics. I understand that, you know, KSI put a lot of hard work into it, but maybe he needs to either improve or, you know, focus on his other 75 careers that he has. Now, before we continue with this video, there's an important message I want to share with you. This is Optimus Prime, and Optimus Prime is starving. As you can see, he's so skinny. But do not worry, there's a way you can help. With each subscription that this video gets, Optimus will get one treat. So do not do it for me. Do not subscribe for me. Subscribe for Optimus Prime. 
Yes, I just blackmailed you with puss and boots. And this is the part where Aiden pretended that he doesn't know the Dan TDM beef between him and KSI. Well, there's no beef. It's a KSI versus KSI beef. But, you know, KSI here tries to explain to him what exactly happened. And the true feelings came out. All the... Behind the cameras, after every sentence he said in the response videos that he made about Dan TDM making fun of him, it turned out like we all predicted, yes, indeed, he was crying after he made that video, before he made that video, later on when he goes to put his head on the pillow. Do better. Do better. I know what it is. I don't know the situation. Are you, what happened though? So he came at your product and then what? He came, he came at my company and then I came back at him several times and then he just peaced out and acted like nothing ever happened. And you know, fair play. He's posting pictures with his kid about him living life. I'm happy for him. But you know, I'm a fire. So when someone comes at me, I'm going to go at them hard 10 times, 20 times, 30 times harder. I just think it's ridiculous. It's like, bro, no, 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 honestly, it's like a boxing match. It's like me and you going in a boxing match, you calling my mom ugly and fat and then peacing out and going back home. Like, where are you going? Wait, she, huh? he called your mom ugly and fat? No, he did not. I'm, I'm giving you just enough. Oh, my God. I'm not, it's not for real, bro. Dude, do you have, like, steroid rage? Like, why are you so mad? Holy oh, fuck. What do you mean? Why am I so mad? Have you seen what I've been going through? Okay, These but I'm not... Days. I'm not... I'm not mad. I'm not them. It's me happy releasing my music and then I've got people trolling online repeatedly and there's nothing I can do. Let's and it pisses me off. So keep the cool. Yo, keep the no, no, I'm sorry. F your, f your shitty audience, bro. They're like, cry, cry. Yo, f all your moms, bro. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't say f the moms. How are you mad that your song is ass, bro? Like, why are you taking out my chat? No. J JJ, I'm trying to be nice, but no, you, you can't talk to my no, community like that, bro. No, no, no. Uh, your song's already a meme. What do you want to happen now? What is your, what is your, what is I your I just wanted to happen? stop. I wanted to stop. I want people to stop making fun of my song. For example, bro, imagine, imagine putting your heart and soul into a project and then release it into a world and everyone's going, ha ha, ass, trash, <laughs> you suck, bro. Kill yourself. Yeah, they don't, you don't deserve it. Wait, how does your community- how, do you, how does that make you feel? JJ, you've been on the internet for how many years now? I mean, you should be used to that stuff. Yeah, but it's when it's my music, it's personal. Yeah, but what do you I'm want? literally making music about my life. Screen to the ring, to the pen, to the king. I'm literally talking about every aspect in my life. And people are making fun of it. Oh, that's what that means. Because you're... Oh. What do you mean, oh, that's what that means? Now, I died watching this whole video on how donkey Aiden is. It looks like he's acting, but I highly doubt that he's acting. He's the type of person who speaks out of his ass and whatever comes out, comes out. And KSI, like you said, he made this whole song about his whole life. And when it comes to people trolling his music, it is personal. I kind of feel bad and not bad for him. The reason I feel bad for him is I understand what he's saying. He, he puts his heart and soul into it. It's like, for example, you work weeks on a gift or, a, you know, a birthday present for your partner, you put your heart and soul into it and she sees it, it's like, uh, okay, thank, thanks, babe. It hurts. And the reason I don't feel bad for it, I'm sure people came up to him and be like, KSI, now uh, you're my friend for like 10 years. I have to tell you, the lyrics are cringe. Maybe change up a little bit. My kink, 40 something million subs. That's what I've been told. Like he doesn't keep track of his subscribers, but he knows he has like 40 something. That's what they told him. I don't know about no ice, I'm just cold. <laughs> Dab after what you just said as well, because that is the only way it will make it less cringe. Now, his team also tried to talk to him and, you know, tell him about this whole hate. Just go with it. Don't take it too personal. It will pass on. The more you fight it, the more people are going to troll. And I think they're right. JJ, the song is catchy. What? I can't get out of my fucking head. Yeah. But people are laughing and it's making it bigger. So just run with it, man. It's not your worst song. Well, well, song. The reason you care mean? so much is it's a song. Don't mean run with it. Stop trying to fight them and defeat don't them fight, and, yeah. and not make it a meme because the more you do that, the more people meme it. The bigger they make it, the more clips you give them. Yeah, but then, but then the it doesn't help when you guys are to the screen, to the ring, to the king. That, that <laughs> sing! <laughs> sing! <laughs> AJ, sing!
Laugh at it. That's funny with it. What? what? But then what do I do? You laugh at I'm us. I'm there looking like a fucking dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> no, you laugh at us though. Honestly, if they wouldn't have made fun of KSI in this situation, I would think that, you know, they're not that close. They're fake on the screen. They're not really friends behind it. This proves it that they're actually friends and that close. Now, sure, you put your heart and soul into it, but this can be a learning lesson that the next one, don't say, I am the king. He comes up, he says uh, from the you know screen to the ring, to the pen, to the ring, to the king. He thought that he's going to be a king. Everyone's going to be like, my king, I love this music video so much. But instead, everyone just started trolling him. And now he's upset that no one's worshipping him. Even his own brother was trying to support him, but he couldn't stop laughing during his reaction. Everybody knows. <laughs> 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 Although he tried to keep a straight face and be supportive of his own brother, he was a little bit, but mostly he just laughed and spat on KSI's face. I'm pretty sure they had a whole argument behind the screen. But KSI took it to Twitter to express more emotions as well, and this is what he said. He posted a picture of Martin Lawrence replying to KSI, think of it, saying, how y'all feel about this new song? And then under it, it says the post has been deleted. He goes on and says, oh my god, he deleted the tweet. I see, I don't know what the this is why are people too lazy to type out words he says why does everyone hate me <laughs> he's asking for it he's asking to get trolled in this whole thing i guess jj you're losing your kingdom and the king is being very hated right now but no king comes out and says why does everyone hate me <laughs> He posted this yesterday, living the dream picture of his cat's prime lunch sleep, picture of his body and his, <clears throat> how can I say this, his, uh, his throne. And right now he's beefing with the people on Twitter, replying to people who have anime pictures who are roasting him. And honestly, at this point, I hope KSI gets the help he needs. I kind of feel bad for him. It's all fun and jokes. Yes, the song is bad, but it's not that bad. We're all like, you know, just going with it because he's reacting this way and he's just making it much more fun for us. But anyways, just wanted to talk about this as usual. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Like, subscription if you're new here. Take it easy. I'll see you at the next one.